hey guys in this video i will say about routing using parameter so guys first of all if you don't know how to create routing and child routing then go to the description and check the link after watching this video it will be more understandable for you so guys i will show an overview of this project so here is the overview you, you can see the contact component and if i click the i i employee john then here the uh, url will be employee slash id1 and if i click uh, alex and here the url will be employee slash id2 and the page will be go to employee page so which i already created so now you can see the here is the employee component which i already generated so uh, for this view i created uh, an array so here is the array if you don't know how to create array you can pause the video and write the code and i will discuss about array in another video here i will give you some overview of an array so here is the interface employee interface where i write the type of the object in number and uh, id number and name is string the interface contains the type of an object so i write the type of here uh, in here and now the employee uh, array i used a variable and the variable type is employee interface because I declare all uh, type into the employee interface and I create an array here is the id1 and name is john and id2 and name is alex and the employee array contains array now and now in the below of the page I declare all employee array into the variable employee all and now i will go to the contact component.html file and here you can, you can see i used png for of loop because in for of loop uh, return the value of array objects we need a value id value and name value so i used ng for of loop and the employee all uh, and con, em, employee all co contains all array and so i uh, i used the employees variable here and now employees variable contains all the value of array and here is the employees id and employees name so now I, I will show you how to create routing so first of all guys i will go to the app module.ts page and here is the app module.ts page and you know when we generated a component then it's automatically imported in app module.ts file so here is the employee component automatically imported so i will copy from here and I will close the app module.ts file and now I will open app mod route, routing module.ts file and I will paste the import import code so I already imported employee component into the app routing module.ts file and now I will go for route so here is the route and now I will type here curly bracket path colon if the path employee and slash colon id so if the path employee and slash id then component employee component and i will save this and now i will go to the contact component.html file and here i will write a click function so brackets click equals to the function name is employee details and here i will pass a parameter so employees variable now contains the all the value of array so we need a id value in the in the url so here i will pass employees variable so I will copy this function and I will go to the contact component.ts file here and here I will paste the function and I will declare it. So this dot router dot navigate. So router means the contact contact page. So the contact page will be navigate when the path is employee comma and the employees id 
so the when the path is employee slash employee id then the router router means the contact page will be navigate so i have to import the router so import router from angular slash router and in in the constructor so here is a constructor private router and the type is router so i will save this and in the contact component.html file i will save this and i will go to the browser and here is the view and so now if i click the first employee so it will be go to the employee page and the url will be employee slash id1 so let's see so you can see the employee works that means it's employee page and here is the url employee slash id1 and now i will go to the back so now i will click the second employee you can see the employee slash id2 and the, it it's a employee page so this is the parameter route routes